Hey guys, welcome to another video. So today I'm going to talk about some things I wear with Jimmy Choo by Jimmy Choo. So if you're interested in seeing what I wear with Jimmy Choo, keep on watching. So if you've seen my top 10 fragrance videos, then you know that this is my all-time favorite perfume, has been forever, and no one has dethroned it as of yet. Had a couple of close calls, but no one has as of yet. So the main accords are sweet, patchouli, fruity, woody, warm, spicy, caramel, earthy, green, floral, aquatic, and the notes. The top notes are pear, mandarin, orange, green note, the middle notes orchid, and the base notes are toffee and patchouli. So for me, I can wear Jimmy Choo all year long. I do wear it in the day and the evening. I tend to wear it more in the evening, but I will wear it in the daytime but I do tend, like I said, to wear it in the evening. So some of my pairings I've picked are ones that, you know, I'm a go-to for the evening. And then on those occasions when I wear it, want to wear it in the daytime, I have some myths for those. So the first one we'll start with is A Thousand Wishes. A Thousand Wishes, this pairing was actually a happy accident. I love A Thousand Wishes. It's one of my favorite Bath & Body Works body sprays. And the fragrance notes are Pink Prosecco, Sparkling Kinks, Crystal Peonies, Gilded Amber, and Amaretto Creme. And the first time I wore these together, like I said, was a happy accident. I was just kind of doing my thing after the shower, getting ready to head out with some friends, and just grabbed A Thousand Wishes. And I knew I wanted to wear Jimmy Choo that night, but I just grabbed a thousand wishes, sprayed it on. And then I was like, oh, that's not what I meant to put on, but whatever. So I put on Jimmy Choo and I actually really enjoyed it. For me, that sparklingness that's in a thousand wishes kind of, kind of enhanced this or added that sparkling thing to Jimmy Choo. Wouldn't necessarily say that you could still smell a thousand wishes because Jimmy Choo is a really strong perfume. So it's not too many things that you can put on with that and Jimmy Choo doesn't dominate. I just liked how it just kind of made it bubbly. So it was still very much Jimmy Choo, but it was Jimmy Choo with a little, you know, Prosecco. So I enjoyed it. It's one that I'll, you know, reach for every now and again, now intentionally. It isn't necessarily, it is definitely not my go-to for uh, wearing with Jimmy Choo when I go out in the evening. But I do enjoy it and it's a nice little change when, you know, I want to wear something. So that is A Thousand Wishes. So next is Little Black Party Dress. Little Black Party Dress is not available currently at Bath & Body Works. They brought it back. They brought it out a while ago and they haven't brought it back. You can still find it around. Like this one I found on Amazon for a pretty reasonable price. And so it actually compared to being a the body spray dupe of Jimmy Choo. And I completely agree with that. So the notes are frosted nectarine, black peony, and white patchouli. It really does, you know, remind me a lot of Jimmy Choo. Is it an exact dupe? But it definitely has that Jimmy Choo vibe. I don't I haven't used it a lot. One, because it's hard to find, but also honestly, it's just not go-to for this. And so I have to get better about trying to reach for it because it's not like I'm trying to save it or anything. I just, this isn't the one that I think of. I plan on trying to use this a little more, but definitely enjoy it. It, it smells like Jimmy Choo. So of course I like it because I love Jimmy Choo. So that is Little Black Party Dress. Okay, Into the Night. Now this is my go-to pairing. My Into the Night that I'm actually working on is in my bedroom. This is a backup, so that's why it's full. <laughs> but I love this pairing. I had a favorites video about it. I've mentioned it in a couple of previous videos. This is this is my go-to when I wear Jimmy Choo. I, Jimmy Choo and Into the Night. I do the entire Into the Night shower lotion thing and then this pairing. So Into the Night is Raspberry Noir, Amber Crystals, Velvety Rose Petals, Cream Patchouli, and Mocha Musk. I just love this. When I read the, when I started wearing Into the Night, I immediately thought, I think this would go well with Jimmy Choo. And it did. It does. I love it. And this is my go-to. I don't even think about it most of the time, which is why I haven't really used Little Black Party Dress. Because if I'm going to wear Jimmy Choo, I pop on Into the Night, Jimmy, and we're out the door. So if you have Into the Night and you have Jimmy Choo, try these together because I really think you'll like it. It's just something about that raspberry and mocha musk that mixes so well, and patchouli that mixes so well with the patchouli in here. Just, you know, my really go-to number one pairing for Jimmy Choo. So that is Into the Night by Bath & Body Works. 
Okay, so now to Victoria's Secret Body Mist. So the first one, I have worn this in the evening, but I do tend to want to wear it in the daytime if I'm going to wear it with Jimmy Choo. So that is Midnight Bloom. Midnight Bloom is Moonflower, Creamy Woods, and Star Cross Lovers. This has been compared to In the Stars by Bath & Body Works, which is also compared to, you know, Cloud, that Baccarat Rouge, that kind of vibe. So that gives you a sense of kind of what this smells like. It's just a very nice, easy going scent to me. And to me, it just it brings like a little airiness to Jimmy Choo, which is why I think it's nice to wear it in the daytime if I'm going to wear Jimmy Choo in the daytime. But again, I typically wear Jimmy Choo at night. So this is not something that I reach for a lot, but I have worn it. I like it together. And it's one of those things that I think it's an easy reach because it doesn't, it doesn't do too much to Jimmy Choo and Midnight Bloom this is a nice, soft, kind of cloudy, airy fragrance. So the bottle for this is exactly kind of what it smells like, honestly. So this is always available at Victoria's Secret. Sometimes you have to get it online, but they, they have it. So that is Midnight Bloom. Okay, so now the next one is Pure Seduction Heat. Pure Seduction Heat is one of my favorite. The Heat Flanker period line is one of my favorites from Victoria's Secret. If you've seen my, if you haven't seen my Pure Seduction video, I will link it below. Pure Seduction Heat is sparkling raspberry, sun-kissed hibiscus, Pure Seduction heats up. I really enjoy this. I think this is, this to me, wearing it this with Jimmy Choo in the daytime is kind of like my daytime version of wearing it with Into the Night. So I could wear this in the day, transition to Into the Night if I wanted to wear Jimmy Choo all day. But this, to me, I just like it in the daytime. I think it's just a nice, summery, fun, pure seduction. And I think that mixes well with wearing Jimmy Choo in the daytime. That raspberry in there just really adds to, you know, the Jimmy Choo. And I enjoy it. My active one I'm using is in my room. So this is my backup. And like I've said, if I can, I'd like to show backups if I have them, which I do for pretty much everything. So that's why my bottles are always full because I just like how that looks. But uh, I do wear this combo when I wear Jimmy Choo in the daytime and I've enjoyed it ever since I've gotten heat line. I just really like those the heat body, body sprays. So that is Pure Seduction Heat with Jimmy Choo. Okay, so the last fragrance we're going to talk about is Pure Glace from Victoria's Secret. They had this and then they took it away and now it's back. So I'm not sure if it's back to stay or what, but it's been around, it's been back for a while. So hopefully it's back to stay because I really do enjoy this. And it is sugared pear, dewy lemon, ooh la la. And I grabbed this because I really thought, okay, this would be a great way to highlight the pear in Jimmy Choo. And it does. It also is a way that I can wear this during the daytime and, you know, take a little bit of that kind of heaviness that I love about Jimmy Choo for the nighttime and kind of take it out in the day and wear it in the day with Pierre Glace. These mix very well together. I really enjoy pair of fragrances and I enjoy the pair in Jimmy Choo. And so this for me is a way that I could kind of bring that pair a little forward and push the patchouli back a little bit. You're never going to push the patchouli away completely in Jimmy Choo by Jimmy Choo because this is a patchouli scent. But by using Pierre Glace, it definitely you know, then you can really smell that pear, which I enjoy. And again, more of a daytime one for me. Okay, guys, so that's it for this video. These are all have been things that I wear with Jimmy Choo. These aren't the only things that I wear with Jimmy Choo, but these are the ones that come to mind as far as most reached for. You know, because I love this fragrance and I've had it so long, I've mixed it with quite a few things. But these are the ones that like I think you guys would enjoy if you enjoy Jimmy Choo. So I hope this video has you know, piqued your interest on Jimmy Choo if you don't have it. And if you do have it, kind of gave you some thoughts on different things that you can wear with it. As always, thank you guys so much for watching. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I will see you at the next one. Bye.